you think the deadly reptiles only existed in prehistoric times, you better think again. The world is still full of scaly, cold-blooded killers. Take, for instance, a snake so large and so deadly that some people worshipped it as a god. And, of course, the deadliest reptile living on the planet today. The Death Adder. Ever find yourself in Australia or New Guinea, you're gonna want to keep an eye out for this little fella. Australia, they'll keep out an eye for everything else. Sure, he might look cute with his stocky build and triangular-shaped head, but trust me, he ain't one to mess with. What makes this thing so dangerous, you may ask? Well, let me tell ya, it's got venom that packs a serious punch. One bite from a Death Adder contains enough venom to kill several humans. In fact, the Death Adder has one of the highest mortality rates of any venomous snake in the world. That's right, it's up there with the big boys. Not just the venom that makes the Death Adder so deadly, though. Guy got some serious attitude as well. Unlike most snakes, which are content to slither away when they encounter a human, the Death Adder is known to be highly aggressive. If it feels threatened or cornered, it's gonna strike without warning. Not something you wanna mess around with. Eastern Brown Snake This snake is known for being one of the deadliest in the world. Not the kind of snake you wanna mess around with unless you're into living dangerously or not long at all. The venom of the Eastern Brown Snake is no joke. It contains neurotoxins and procoagulants that can cause paralysis, internal bleeding, and organ failure. In other words, it's not the kind of venom you want coursing through your veins. And if you think you can outrun this snake, think again. Eastern Brown Snake is one of the fastest snakes out there, capable of striking multiple times in quick succession. But let's not forget about its attitude. This snake is highly territorial and won't hesitate to strike if it feels threatened. That means you don't want to get too close to this guy. Remember, he's not a cuddly pet. If you do happen to get bitten by an Eastern Brown Snake, don't worry, there is anti-venom available. But you'll want to act fast. The window of opportunity for treatment is small, and you don't want to be caught slacking. The Nile Crocodile The Nile Crocodile, the ultimate predator of the African waterways and a fun name to say, is big, powerful, and one of the deadliest creatures on the continent. The Nile Crocodile can grow up to 20 feet long and weigh over a ton. It's like having a small car with tea swimming around. When it comes to biting, this crocodile means business. Its bite force is strong enough to crush bones and tear apart prey with ease. Not only is it big, it's stealthy as well. Been known to lurk near river crossings, waiting for unsuspecting prey to wander into its path. Talk about a sneaky snack attack. Now crocodiles are apex predators, feeding on a variety of animals, including fish, birds, mammals, and the occasional human. Yeah, unfortunately, we're not safe here. If you're ever in their territory, it's best to keep your distance and let them do their thing, as they're the cause of more human deaths in Africa than any other predator. The Gila Monster Ah, the Gila Monster. One of the most interesting and unique lizards in the world. This colorful reptile is known for its distinctive orange and black pattern, and for being one of the only two venomous lizards in the entire world. Okay, now I know what you're thinking. Venomous lizard? Sounds terrifying. Don't worry though, the Gila monster isn't as dangerous as its venom reputation might suggest. In fact, Gila monsters are actually quite docile and are unlikely to attack humans unless they feel threatened. Plus, their venom is primarily used for subduing prey, not for defense, so you'd have to really provoke one to get a bite. That being said, still not a good idea to mess with a Gila monster. Their venom is potent and can cause pain, swelling, and nausea in humans, and if left untreated, a bite could potentially be fatal. In addition to their venomous bite, Gila monsters are also known for their ability to store fat in their tails, which they can live off for for months at a time. They're also surprisingly slow moving for a lizard, and can often be found basking in the sun or burrowing underground to escape the heat. The American Alligator American gators can grow up to 14 feet long and weigh over a thousand pounds. It's like having a small car with a tail in your backyard. They have a lifespan of up to 50 years in the wild, so if you see an older alligator, make sure to give it some respect for its years of experience. Question is, are alligators dangerous? Well, yeah. Long answer, yeah. I mean, alligators are incredibly strong and fast, and their jaws are powerful, can easily crush bone. However, they generally only attack humans if they feel threatened or we get too close to their nest or food source. So if you encounter an alligator, just remember to give it plenty of space, or try to take a selfie with it. Alligators, though, aren't all scary teeth and sharp claws. Did you know that they're actually quite social creatures? They communicate with each other through a series of grunts, hisses, and bellows, and even care for their young by protecting them and sometimes even carrying them in their mouths. It's like a family of scaly dinosaurs. 
the Gaboon Viper. Found in the rainforests and savannas of sub-Saharan Africa, this serpent is a true marvel of nature. Let me give you some quick and fascinating facts about this slithery little creature. Firstly, the Gaboon Viper is a master of camo. Its scale patterns perfectly blend with the forest floor, making it almost impossible to spot. Not an easy thing to do given the fact that this serpent can grow up to six feet long. Now, let's talk about the elephant in the room. The Gaboon Viper's Venom. This snake bite is one of the most lethal in the world and it can deliver a whopping 300 milligrams of venom in a singular bite. That's enough to kill a human being in as little as 30 minutes. I wouldn't worry too much though. While its venom is certainly potent, Gaboon Vipers are not known for being aggressive and will only strike if provoked. The King Cobra. Ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce to you the King Cobra. He ain't your average snake. This slithery serpent is one of the most venomous snakes in the world, and it's no joke. Firstly, let's talk about its venom. The King Cobra's venom is so toxic that it can kill up to 20 humans with a singular bite. That's right, snake means business. And with a length of up to 18 feet, it's not a creature you want to mess with. But it's not just its size and venom that makes it dangerous. This snake is aggressive, and it will attack humans if it feels threatened or cornered. And get this, it's known to pursue and attack people who try to escape. That's some next level predatory and angry behavior right there. Now I know some of you may think that this snake is just a scary predator, but in many cultures it's revered and considered sacred. Heck, in some Asian countries it's even worshipped. But that doesn't mean you should try to capture or handle it. Leave the snake handling to the professionals. The Matamata -mata Turtle. Let's talk about the Matamata -mata Turtle, a unique and fascinating creature from the Amazon and Orinoco River basins in South America. This freshwater species has a distinctive appearance that often leads people to mistake it for a pile of leaves or debris in the water. But don't be fooled by its appearance, as the Matamata -mata Turtle is not dangerous at all. Despite looking like it came straight from the depths of heck, the Matamata -mata Turtle is actually quite harmless. Its bite isn't powerful enough to cause serious injury to humans, and it's not venomous either. So if you ever come across one of these turtles in the wild, there's no need to be afraid. The Matamata -mata Turtle is a carnivorous creature that preys on fish, insects, and other small aquatic animals. Its hunting style is unique and involves a rapid expansion of its head and neck to create a powerful suction that sucks in prey. It's an ambush predator, waiting patiently for prey to swim within range before striking. Sadly, the Matamata -mata Turtle is considered a threatened species due to habitat loss and poaching for the pet trade. The Inland Taipan The Inland Taipan may not be the biggest snake out there, averaging only about 6 feet in length, but never underestimate the damage a bite from one of these snakes can cause. Found in the remote semi-arid regions of Central Australia, the venom of a single bite is potent enough to kill a hundred fully grown men. Yeesh. The Inland Taipan's venom is a complex mixture of neurotoxins, procoagulants, and myotoxins. Neurotoxins attack the nervous system and can cause paralysis. Meanwhile, procoagulants promote blood clotting and can lead to stroke or heart attack. Myotoxins can affect the muscles, causing pain and damage to the kidneys. A bite from an Inland Taipan can cause symptoms to appear quickly, often within minutes. Victims may experience difficulty breathing, paralysis, and renal failure. And in severe cases, death can occur within hours if left untreated. Despite its highly venomous nature, the Inland Taipan is not typically aggressive towards humans. It prefers to avoid confrontation and retreats if it feels threatened. However, if it is cornered or feels trapped, it will strike repeatedly and deliver a large amount of venom with each bite. Luckily, encounters with the Inland Taipan are rare due to its remote habitat. The Saltwater Croc Did you know that the Saltwater Croc is the largest living reptile on Earth? These guys can grow up to 23 feet long and weigh over 2,000 pounds, basically the size of a small car. Now, you might think that an animal that big would be pretty slow and lumbering, but hey, you'd be wrong. Saltwater crocs are surprisingly agile and can move quickly both on land and in the water. Don't let their impressive size and speed fool you. Saltwater crocs are also one of the most dangerous animals in the world. They're known for being aggressive and territorial and have been known to attack humans without provocation. In fact, in Australia alone, an average of two humans are killed by this reptile per year for the past decade. One of the reasons why saltwater crocs are so dangerous is their powerful jaws. They have the strongest bite of any animal in the world, with a force of up to 3,700 pounds per square inch. That's strong enough to crush an entire car, let alone a human. See you all next time.